true. Peace, Kins and Kinnets. I am back at y'all with another one. And if you're trying to stay ahead of the game, man, you should go on ahead and subscribe to Peep the Slang. Clearview AI makes face biometric service available to Ukraine Ministry of Defense. Peep the Slang. Database holds 2 billion images from Russian social media, man. Peep the Slang. I can't even say the name of the social media. Clearview AI is providing its facial recognition to the Ukrainian Defense Ministry to assist in identifying people, possibly at checkpoints, or to identify the deceased. The biometric app was offered up free of service by Clearview to assist Ukrainians with identification and combating misinformation in a letter from CEO Ho'an Tan that advisor Lee Woloski told Rudis that it could be used to vet people at checkpoints, among other applications, man, peep the slang. It is not clear exactly what Clearview's facial recognition is being used for at this time. The company say it has more than 2 billion images from Russian social media site V. Contacente among its database of 10 billion photos. And please, if somebody know the real name, uh, pronunciation of that, comment. Ukraine's Ministry of Digital Transformation previously said that it was weighing offers of support from American artificial intelligence providers, but the country's Ministry of Defense declined to comment. Tom that wrote in the letter seen by Reuters that Clearview's facial recognition could identify deceased people more easily than fingerprint biometrics and would work even if the victims had sustained facial injuries and also suggested the use of the app for reuniting families torn apart by the war. He also suggested using it to identify Russian operatives. Telling that, and Woloski said that Ukrainian government agencies beyond the Ministry of Defense are expected to deploy Clearview in the near future. Woloski also said Clearview's Vicante uh, images give a larger database than the PMIs which has been used to identify people shown in photos of the war. The same offer has not been extended to Russia. Clearview has been attempting to reform an image battered by accusations of mass surveillance and of violating the terms of conditions of social media networks like Twitter in violation of the privacy of their users. It is also facing a growing list of fines from regulators. Man, people slain. The company submitted its biometric algorithm to the U.S. National Institute of Standards and Technology, VRVT, benchmarking evaluation and claim high marks in accuracy and racial parity, emphasized its roles in identifying participants in the riot at the U.S. Capitol on January the 6th, 2021. Turned that told Reuters that Clearview service should never be solely relied on for identification and that the company expects its technology to be used in compliance with the Geneva Convention. The report also notes that civil society group, the Surveillance Technology Oversight Project warns that technology introduced on the battlefield are prone to misuse. Man, people slain, clear view.